Hi guys, welcome to this MySQL tutorial and in this tutorial we will focus on how to insert data into the table we created last time. So I have already browsed through to my folder where my MySQL application is present. So now I have to connect to my MySQL server. So I will do MySQL minus u username is root minus p I don't have a password then minus h host name is 127.0.0.1 I don't have a password so I'll just press enter so it says you are connected to MySQL if in your case for any reason it is showing that some error has occurred then just go ahead and open up your XMPV control panel and check here if the MySQL server is running if it is not running then press on start it will start running then redo the thing and it will start again so in the last tutorial we created a database called user login and inside the database we created a table called user and inside that table we inserted some parameters four parameters actually id username password and email id so in this tutorial we'll just insert data into that table so first of all i will do a show database show databases there it is user login now again i'll write use user login i'll write show tables so there is one table user so i'll just write describe user so here it is four parameters are present id username password and email and these are all the characteristics of those parameters so in this tutorial we'll just insert data into those fields so let's start by writing insert into our table name is user and we'll start the parenthesis here we don't have to insert the value of id because it is set to auto increment so it will automatically increase so we'll just have to insert the values for username password and email i'll just press enter here and here i'll write my values values so our username is a varkar of 25 characters so for varkar you have to use single quotes remember that you have to only use single quotes because double quotes won't work for mysql so suppose my username is prime tiver comma my password will be suppose one two three four five and suppose my email id is a b c one two three at the rate of hotmail dot com now i'll close my parenthesis here end the statement and press enter so it says query ok one row affected now we have just inserted values into our table and we can see those values by typing in select star from user star means everything from user so here it is id equals to 1 username is prime tiver password is 12345 and email is abc123 at the rate of hotmail.com now i will enter another set of data into this table so i will write insert into our table name is user and id I don't have to enter so username then password then email I don't have to press enter I just can write values and I'll start with username suppose username is java password is java net and email id is java c at the rate of gmail.com 
I'll end the parenthesis add semicolon and press enter it says query ok one row affected now to see all the data present in the table I will write select star from user and add semicolon and press enter so here it is when id is 1 the username is prime tiver password is 12345 and email is this when id is 2 username is java password is javanet and email is this so this is for this tutorial and in the next tutorial we'll talk more about updating a database and selecting from databases so thank you for watching and if you like the video don't forget to subscribe